What behind the scenes magic do you do to ensure that the village free school actually continues to exist and, and is, is vibrant? To me, just personally, I think the level of care and the relationship that we have and feel like we commit to each other. And this is, I'm just only going to speak for the staff, like the working group that we have, mm -hmm. you know, as like the main folks that show up at school every day to be there for the students, to be there for each other, mm -hmm. a deep commitment to care for each other. I think if you really hear and, and understand like what we could do for each other, it w would be pretty profound. How we show up for each other, how we allow each other to be fully who they are and knowing that you know each one of us is different and we bring different things and we mm. try to step up and step down for each other and mm, it's almost like each one of us bring our own specific gift and we create the space for that to all be present mm. together so mm -hmm. in many ways that you know some like we don't have like the same kind of like we all do these things the same together so yeah, right. so it's not like that we are just who we are and we learn to commit to each other like deeply and to learn what the other persons are like knowing that this is all we need to yeah. make this happen so that's kind of how i feel and it's very very special and i know that it sounds quite abstract two of our staff have two babies and so like mm -hmm. they bring their kids to school and we get to see how these kids are raised and we rest them together and mm -hmm. you know one of them is nine one of them is almost two I've been at the school almost 10 years so we have staff who you know we're all just a diverse in ourselves. it's just kind of all that little spatial magic that all of us ha like possess a little bit and then it's just kind of filled in together in the pot <laughs> This is the Agentic Schools Podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg. <laughs>